to chill with the Cheneys. You want to sit up straight, have some good posture here? I have terrible posture. I'm try. Part two. This is part one because this is Amazon packages. It's not just Amazon packages, it's a variety of packages. It's episode two. So I'm aware I look a hot mess. I really didn't feel like getting dressed or ready Me today. Either. Yeah. So this is what you get. But if you guys, most of you are over here from Instagram, so you already know. But not me, because I don't, I don't do stories like you do. Yeah. You would never look hot, Miss. You're I'm so a handsome. disaster. Look at my hair. You're so handsome. All right, Almost. you ready? So, so many of you love the little mini series on Instagram stories I did of Amazon's, Amazon's, Andrew's Amazon hauls. <laughs> we thought we would share. I have no idea. So there's some things in here that he already purchased that I know of, but there is a whole pile in front of me of things that I don't know what they are. So we're all we're all seeing this together. Are you ready to go time. on an adventure? Because I forget what I order sometimes too. That's what makes it so much fun. It's like Christmas every day. Yep. So if you have wine or a cocktail, I have wine because I feel like it's going to be very needed. Jameson. We oh, should sponsor I, the video. That'd be great. I thought it was Whistle Pig. No, this oh, is Jameson. I also got. You can't see it. I got Andrew this glass. It has Darth Vader on it. With the Darth Vader uh, ice cube in it? Yes. Fantastic. All right, you ready? Let's dive right in. The show on the road. Can I cut your hair? Nope. Your hat. Wait, wait, wait. Why don't you do the stuff that you already bought first? We'll, we'll start with this because it's the biggest and it's my favorite. And I haven't, got, I haven't got to use this yet. So there's some other items that just, I've already been using them. I decided to dive into charcoal grilling versus gas grilling recently. Because I really wanted to cook a brisket. And you can't cook a brisket on a gas grill. I, I don't care who you are, you just can't do it. So I got myself my Weber kettle and started buying my items to um, do some grilling with. One of the things needed, giant cutting board. <laughs> um, I think this is like 36 inches by like 18 inches or something. Yeah, it's big because I plan on doing some big boys. And uh, you need that so you can uh, prep it and so you can slice it. I want to do some ribs and do some ribs too. Do you want to know how Taylor found out about this cutting board? <laughs> it's a great story. Sometimes Andrew surprises me with stuff. I never know what's coming. So sometimes there's stuff for me and sometimes there's just stuff for him. And so one day this big ass box shows up and I got excited. And so I opened it. Keep talking. I forgot. I opened it. And as I'm opening it, I'm like, is this for me? And he smiled like he was he has this look when he's lying you'll probably see it in this video when he's lying or trying to hide something um and he made that face i was like oh my god it is and i opened it and i was so excited it was that fucking cutting board that cutting board that takes up all of the space underneath the stove where the pots and pats where the pots and pans go it was one happy girl oh god i don't know where they're at oh, i'll save them for another video Oh, I thought you were talking about those slippers that you got on. Oh, you bit this next. Oh, son of a bitch. Moving on, so Instagram got me. <laughs> well, it wasn't it. Well, yeah, I guess it was Instagram. Under Armour was running like a 40% off like summer sale. And I got me a pair of some mossy oak camo slides to wear around the house. They really and get me going. She told me these are so ugly and yada, yada, yada. Then I caught her trying to wear them. I wear them because they're, e they're easily accessible when I have to go to the front porch to get all your she... fucking packages off the porch. I got these explicitly because I knew she wouldn't wear them because of the color. And yet, here we are, still wearing my stuff. Welcome, Please, welcome to the next to marriage. Pair. can't believe I did this. <laughs> I can't believe you did this either. I'm really upset about this, and I don't like to talk about it, but we're going to talk about it. It's okay. You're, it's, this is a safe space. No, it's not. It is. I finally caved and got a pair of the good old Crocs. <laughs> I, I just want to talk about it. Other than the fact that I found out they make the same color. So I got gray ones just because I said I'm not going to talk about it. But I got gray just because it's a neutral color. They also have um, real tree camel, which my little brother got and I'm considering getting. They also have an American flag pattern, which I'm also considering getting. And then I found out that they make them in Aiden's size. So her and I are definitely getting matching Crocs. That's no happening. other way to do it. That's happening. Yeah. Um, very disappointed in myself that I got them. I think they're comfy. I think... I think we're I'm out. mad because they're so ugly, but they're so comfortable. So everyone who told me, do you gotta get them, you gotta get them. I'll admit it, you, everyone was right. And I hate it because I hate them, but I love them. They're so comfortable. I feel like we're at an age, at a point in our life where comfort over style. No, we can move on now. I'm done talking about the Crocs. Which, this was a shot in the dark. 
Because we just have a lot of pans. Pan or pam? Is there two ends on the end? Pan. Pan. Pam. 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 It is a pan organizer. It is supposed to sit on the counter or in your cupboard. And you're supposed to be able to slide. I'll just, I'll sit over here. Your this pans. your video. No, no, no. You come here. Okay. Your pan's in there. So that way they're all stacked on top of each other. You said it didn't work very well. I, I don't know. I, I didn't, she, she opened it. She tried it. Pans. We need more. We need another one. Okay. Well, I just thought it didn't work. So I don't know. I mean, review to come on whether it works or not. This is going to go into the, like the, the D, like not the DIY, what'd you say? Like hacks, like life hacks. These aren't really a life hack, but it's just like, hey, if you have an issue with pans, Andrew found this on Amazon and it may work for you. I don't have a promo code like Cheney 10 or anything. So just, I'll, we'll drop the. We'll be cool enough at some point to get promo codes. I'm going to, I will, we'll, I'll tell you what's going to happen with all this stuff. We're going to, we're going to drop the, um, the links in the description below. That's how YouTubers do it. They point down like this and then like, it's usually in there. No, no, that's not what we're doing, but we'll okay. just continue. Another hack, Cheney hack. I, th I like this hack. Okay. I, are we're we doing getting hacks? to the packages. Okay. We're doing hacks now. Go ahead. You want to do the things that were open? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is already open. Okay. Ketchup mustard bottles that you can get from Sam's Club. You can get these from Sam's Club, Amazon, whatever. You can use about like a four pack, five pack. This one's 16 ounces. You don't need them this big, but these work great for everything. Olive oil. You can use them for balsamic vinaigrette. I also use it for dog shampoo because you just buy the big jug of dog shampoo. That's, 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 that's a little convenient. Like try to pour that on your dog and give them a bath. Put it in here and now you can squirt it you can cut this tip to size as needed depending on the viscosity of the liquid you put in here the viscosity that's what that's called you're welcome wow. so I, I love these little things they're great they're cheap they're disposable so if i you know it gets gross after a while throw it away and get a new one cold brew maker moving on i've been through a couple cold brew makers they all sucked i kept going and getting coffee every day we got this guy it's missing a little piece in the middle because, well, we have cold brew in here. Just this guy. This. I don't think you need to show them. I feel like this is going to be disastrous. Attaches to the lid. So this attaches to the lid. This is like a very fine mesh screen. That's my issue with cold brew makers in the past is the filter or screen has not been fine enough. There's a lot of floaties in there. And listen, I don't like floaties in my coffee. So you put your coffee grounds in here. You put your water in there. You put that in there. Screw it on. You let it sit for 12, 24 hours, 48 hours if you're like us and just, you know, let, sh let shit get crazy. And you have your concentrate. This has been the best one so far. The Amazon reviews on it are fantastic. And I can tell you, I, I love this thing. So this is phenomenal. And it's concentrate. So like you have to literally... We like... don't have to talk about that either. Okay. Just when... Yep. Okay. If you buy that, just make sure that you don't pour your whole cup of that. Like... <laughs> Maybe a quarter of the cup, and then the it's rest. It's concentrate. Yeah, it's concentrate. Either add water or creamer or whatever you put in your coffee. Packages from this one. Some of these don't say what they're from. This one says greater half. I don't remember what I ordered. Let's go on a journey together. Knife sponsor, Hogue. They're in Henderson. Great knives. Honey, we, you can't say that. Why no can't? one is sponsoring this video. They're not. No, I'm asking for them to sponsor oh, this okay. video. They're knives, too. They're great. No, I love them. Yeah. They're nice. Knives. All right, so what you got here? Some of this, some of the stuff may not be appropriate for. I'll just edit it in the post. channel. Yep, don't show that. Don't even waste my time. I think flamingo shorts. Never have enough shorts. Are they swimming trunks? They can be whatever you want them to be. Gym shorts, swim trunk. No net in here, so I, I don't like nets anyways. Do net or no net? Comment below. We don't like nets in our swim trunks, but um, yeah, it could be swim trunks or gym shorts or just everyday shorts. But hey, hey, yeah. the, boy, the boys gotta breathe. No nets. I feel like they're gonna. Really be broken. All right, moving on. This one's an Amazon package. What we got here? Oh, uh, yay! The new SD card I got you. So Thank you. You don't so run out of because you keep running out of space on your um, SD card. So I do. That's for you. Thanks. See, sometimes I get surprises. And then this one's for me for my GoPro because I'm gonna start giving you guys daily content from me that she can edit into videos. It's gonna be great stuff. I put this one's from Brute Force Training. I've been, I've always wanted one of these and then I had a reason to get one because they were running a um, red, white, and blue type sale. It's a sand bag training bag. So you fill this with sand 
and then you use it to train with. So you can do cleans with it, you can put it over your back and do back squats with it, you can do whatever you want. You put the sand and the weight varies so you can make the weight change from 25 to 75 pounds. This is your, in, these are, uh, your insert for your sand. So you have your little bags, you fill them up. But yeah. What do you a, plan on doing with that? Working out with it. Oh, okay. Yeah, you fill it up with sand. That's why yeah, I got. Yeah, no, I get that. That's why I got the sand from Home Depot. Mmm. And then I got Vader a toy. So Aw. Little, little chew toy, so you can play tug. There's a squeaky in there. I'm gonna piss Ari off. But yeah, so him, so we can you know play together. Aw, you're so sweet. You get a Vader. <laughs> what the? You know, I was I was really confused at first because. Level cook. What All right. in the fuck? So those, Why? so those those of you who don't know, I am actually half Hispanic, believe it or not. And I love to cook, as you already know. So I did get a mortar and pedestal so I can make guacamole. Where is that gonna go? Somewhere in the kitchen. They were out of stock actually, and it was back in stock, and I said, cool, I'm getting it. When you go to Lindo and they make the guacamole at the table. Mm -hmm. That's what this is. Honey, I know what it is. Okay, well. In the almost three years we've been together, you have never made guacamole for me. I so are you gonna start? How many times a week do you think you're gonna use that? A week? Yeah. Probably maybe one if that. How many times a year do you think you're gonna use that? At least four. All right, so I get quarterly guacamole. I don't know. Worth it? I'm ready. You chugging wine over there? Brave of you to red wine, white sweater. I'm a classy bitch. I didn't say you weren't. It's this one. Why do you look so extra excited about this one? Start with this. This is something I've been wanting to try. We'll let you know how this works out. But um, this is a bottle to bottle coupler thing. So you can get every drop out of the existing, so you buy like the big Dawn dish soap things. Well, you turn them upside down and try oh, to get everything out. Yeah, so this is in a little adapter. So it works for soap, it'll work for lotions, like shampoos and different things like that. So you can get everything out of the old bottle and into and into a new bottle. We'll see how it works. It may or may not work out very well. I tell you right now that the picture showed it as a clear piece of plastic. This is not a clear piece of plastic. So I guess, so. I guess my question here is what is the difference between that and using just the bottle? Does it like suction it out? No, 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 no. When you get to the very bottom mm -hmm. of it, when you turn it upside down, you know how it all drips down the sides and you don't actually get anything out? So you end up throwing that away. Well, but if you let it sit upside down, it actually pulls up to a good amount at the, uh, at, at the now, well, now the top. And when we try to open it, it all spills out. So that allows you to basically put the other bottle on top and then you can set it aside and let it all drain into your new bottle so you don't have any wasted soap, shampoo, so on and so forth. Okay. That's why we have like eight bottles of lotion upstairs because there's actually still a good amount in the very bottom. And I was going to cut them in half. I was just going to cut them open and then take it all out and put it in a new bottle. But now I have a bottle opener. Or not a bottle coupler thing, so that'll work. I got these for the office chair at work. Fantastic. If you have an office chair, do yourself a favor. Get you set of those. They're um, they're basically like rollerblade wheels for your office chair. They're it literally rolls. rollerblade wheels. It says rollerblade wheels on they work the box. Fantastic. This is for an, another upcoming item that's not here yet. If you ordered that ugly ass office chair. Moving on. Oh, this is for my GoPro. More vlog stuff for you guys. You gotta do it for the channel. It's a handy dandy little handle for the GoPro. Like an actual handle with a lanyard so I don't drop it because, you know, I'm clumsy according to you. Ah, my favorite one, my favorite one of all. Let me save the best for last. Did we get bamboozled? Did I get bamboozled? So this time six and you got four. <laughs> Maybe I bought a four pack. It says times six. Yeah, but maybe I bought a four pack and they took the two out. We gotta check now. Hold on, because this is this is pertinent. This is we're going on the adventure together now. You did order that fucking chair. I didn't. You, why would you look at my order history? It's you, I, you can't do that. 
It literally just popped up. No, it didn't. I, ooh. I did order a set of four. Set of four, so they took two out. Okay. I guess I, if I'd known they came in a package of six, I just would have got six. There's no need to you forget you didn't have four. Yeah. What is this for? My friends, we have whiskey tasting glasses. For all the whiskey tastings you conduct in the house? Well, I have a lot of whiskey to taste and bourbon, so on and so forth. Because I have that little, I got that little membership number where I get the little, like the whiskey and mm -hmm. bourbon samples. And I have a bunch that I haven't tried yet. And now I have the proper glass to try them in. Some Whistle Pig. You are really trying to get sponsored. This is, this was, this is by Whistle Pig. It's a 10 year single barrel rye. This was bottled exclusively for Corey's Fine Wine. They're the people behind Panera Bread. I went in there to actually get a bottle of that German Riesling that we had at my parents' house that was really good. They were actually out of it. And then, you know what he recommended to me? Get this. Remember the other one that was garbage and tasted like shit? He said this one's comparable. I didn't bother telling him, no, it's not. I just said, oh, okay. But I know it was that because I remember the little label at the top, the, like the logo that was on it, and I was like, and I saw it, and I said, yeah, no. You said it's a little bit drier than this one? That no, it's a dry. lot drier, and it tasted dry. like butthole. If I had to guess what butthole tasted like, that's what it would be. And I probably wouldn't do it again. But anyways, so I, of course, naturally have to go look at their bourbon and their whiskey and see what they've got, and um, he told me that this was bottled exclusively for them. They they bought a barrel of the a barrel, and it was to benefit. And uh, it was it was I think one of their one of their owners or an owner of something um, had come down with ALS, so all the proceeds from all the bottles of that batch went towards that. So they only had yeah. I think they only had I think two bottles left. So I bought the last two bottles, but um, I do have a lot of whiskey that I would like to taste and try. And I've assumed I should go ahead and get proper glasses to do so because I would like to become a whiskey connoisseur. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. I've been watching a lot of whiskey videos on YouTube. Oh, okay. But anyways, so that's what those glasses are for, is to start trying this stuff. I appreciate your hustle. I don't have what hustle. What? You are trying so hard to get sponsored right now. Ain't no one We should sponsor. name this. We should name this Andrew video. Wants Andrew wants to get sponsored. He wants to get sponsored. Andrew's attempt to get sponsored. Do what you gotta do. Yeah. No, I appreciate your hustle. I appreciate the accumulation of things that you've brought into this you, we should this show video. a picture of the pile. This I honestly the wasn't that. I'm not. But here's the thing: is everything is useful. It it's not like it's useless shit. This I is don't... okay. I know you're not happy about the guacamole maker thing, or the or the what the every drip. It just seems redundant or unnecessary. But how many times have you opened that bottom cupboard and seen a bottle turned upside down because I'm letting everything drain towards the top? so I can put it into the new bottle or use the last of it. Have you ever seen how much soap is wasted? No. Okay, so you wouldn't know. Okay, I wouldn't know. Yeah, I mean, it's, it was, it's, it's all stuff that like, it was useful stuff. It's not like I got stuff, I'm just like over here just buying shit that's like, that was dumb, why did I spend money on that? Some of you may say that. I look at this all useful stuff. The cutting board, I know you don't like it. I love it, it's fucking huge. If you're gonna do anything, just go big or go home. There's not much else coming, actually. All this was supposed to show up today. It showed up yesterday. I was really surprised. We could have done this yesterday. Here we are. All right, so basic, all of these items are going to be under, I'm going to make Andrew make an Amazon list of his own. And so all of the, these things and moving forward, all of his Amazon finds will be on a list, which will be in the description below, as well as in the link in my bio on Instagram. So there you go. There you have it. I have to make a list. I'll just do it for you. It's really not that difficult. I really should never gave you access to my Amazon. I should have made you get your own. That's rude. Yeah, I know. Welcome to marriage. <laughs> Sharing is caring. Yeah, should you talk about the ring light that I bought you? Oh, it's on my... No, it's on the equipment list. Okay. But this is also from Amazon. And I think it's on my it's on my Amazon list, but I'll put it on his as well. Exciting stuff. I'm going to go pour a bottle. Pour a bottle. I'm going to go pour a glass of this whistle pig. You go pour a bottle of that whistle pig. <laughs> yeah, I will. All right. I'm going to buy my own barrel. That'd be a great video. Andrew buys a barrel of whiskey. Let's do it. Lord help me. All right. Adios. <laughs> you got to leave that. You have to leave.